Just so y'all know, this is how much money they gave up after they got rid of Kanye. They fired him, basically, and lost $246 million in the process. But it is what it is, man. Ye done dropped the price of all his products. He is selling them at his own little, you know, neighborhood stores type shit. I think he got $20 hoodies now. Uh, the Yeezys and things of that nature have dropped. The price on those done dropped. I feel bad for anybody that was spending 300 on shoes. All that high price ass shit on shoes. Them bitches is cheap as hell now. It really just changed the whole shoe game. <laughs> Like, tremendously, nigga. You would not be charging nobody over 300, 200, 100, no more for the motherfucking shoes. And, yeah, man, all that because he spoke his fucking mind. And he told the truth. And y'all go look up what Semitic is and look up who the Semitic people are and go look up anti-Semitic. Go look up all that shit and you'll come to find out that he can't be anti-Semitic because he the, he the Semitic person. We the Semitic beings. And for him to say that the 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 banks run by Jews, the, the media ran by Jews, it's the truth. I mean... If being anti-Semitic is telling the truth, then we all anti-Semitic in some kind of way, shape, or form. Motherfuckers don't like for you to call them out on their bullshit. That's all it is. That's that's white people for you. That's Jewish people for you. It's like they'll, they'll do some shit to you and then expect for you to just let it go. When if, you know, you do something to them, they go make sure you get punished to the full extent of the law type shit. Like... We got to stop fucking with these motherfuckers, dog. We don't need them. They need us. Literally, they need us. Like I always be trying to tell y'all, them motherfuckers idolize us. They love us. They really want to be just like us. They want their skin to be dark. Motherfuckers be tanning until their skin fall off because they want to be like us so bad. We melanated. They can never be melanated. They could try all they want. Tanning bed, tanning booth, bitch. Stand in the sun. You go crisp. They go, they go crisp out there, bitch. They would never be us. So, stop trying to be like them when they trying to be like us. If you go, if anything, take the take the financial shit and run with that. But as far as the dumb shit, fuck that. Ignore that shit. Fuck them. Get on your financial shit. Unite. We need our own banks. We need our own hospitals. We need our own fucking schools. I'm homeschooling my daughter. So if you want your child to be homeschooled, holler at your boy. Because I'm homeschooling. We homeschooling our baby. Fuck that. We'll not go to no punk-ass public school to learn how to be a fucking slave. That shit dead. I'm sorry. And the way I see it, if y'all ask to take time to go clubbing and take time to go fucking worry about who baby daddy fucking who baby mama or worry about who sucking who dick or worrying about who getting some money and you not even getting no money, y'all ass got time to sit down and read a book to your child. Y'all ass got time to sit down and do ABCs and one, two, threes with your child. And, hell, and that's all you really need to teach them until they about 13. When they turn 13, now you got to really get into some financial literacy, literacy type shit. You know what I'm saying? What is a bill? How to avoid having a lot of bills? What is a liability? What is an asset? What is a fucking trust fund? Well, I bet y'all don't even know what that is. I'm still trying to figure out completely what the fuck that is. But how to not have to pay taxes, how to have life insurance and use the life insurance while you alive. It's called life insurance for a reason. It's just a lot of shit that people need to get understood based on little shit that happens like this. If they could take everything from you like that, that's a f And I'm going to tell y'all something else. I done been broke a lot of times, but I ain't never been broken. I done been broke a lot of times, but there ain't never been a time that I've been broken. I probably, I, I could say this, if I've been broken, it probably been one or two times, but being broken is worse, way far worse than being broke. I take being broke over being broken any day because being broken, that shit is detrimental to your life, for real. But y'all stay up, man. Make sure y'all taking heed of what I'm saying and not feeling the type of way. If you feel the type of way, it's probably because I'm telling some type of truth, man. So instead of being in your feelings about the shit, get the fuck out your feelings. Men don't get in their feelings. They get on their shit. Females, they get in their feelings a little bit. Then they get on their shit. Either way, it go get on your shit. Stay out your feelings. Let's get to this bread. Let's get to this motherfucking unity. Let's build our own fucking world. It's our world anyways. These motherfuckers just live in it. It's our world.